to study the reactions of ethanol with A. Acidified potassium permanganate solution, B. Felling solution, and C. Ammonical silver nitrate. In this experiment, we will study how ethanol reacts with the compounds listed. A. Reaction of ethanol with acidified potassium permanganate. Add about 5 drops of ethanol to about one fifth of a test tube of acidified potassium permanganate. Using the test tube holder, stand the test tube in a beaker of hot water for a few minutes. Note the colour change and with the aid of your textbook, explain your observation. Repeat the experiment with propanone. Note that there is no colour change. With the aid of your textbook, explain why there is no colour change in the case of the ketone. This concludes the first part of the experiment. Part B. Reaction of ethanol with failing solution. Make up some failing solution by mixing about one tenth of a test tube of failings A with the same quantity of failings B. The mixture should be a clear royal blue colour. Add about 5 drops of ethanol to the test tube containing the failing solution. Using a test tube holder, stand the test tube in a beaker of hot water for a few minutes. Write down what you observe and explain your observation. Write down also the two half reactions taking place. Repeat the experiment with propanone. Note that there is no colour change. With the aid of your textbook, explain your observation. This concludes this part of the experiment. Part C. Reaction of ethanol with ammoniacal silver nitrate, the silver mirror test. 
To one centimetre cubed of a solution of silver nitrate, add one drop of dilute sodium hydroxide solution. A brown precipitate of silver oxide is formed. Add dilute ammonia solution drop by drop until the brown precipitate just redissolves. You have now prepared Tollens reagent. Tollens reagent must always be freshly made up. If stored, it is likely that explosive products will be formed. Take another dry test tube that has been washed out thoroughly with detergent, rinse with ordinary water, and finally with propanone to remove any droplets of water. Pour the Tollens reagent into the clean test tube. Add about three drops of ethanol. And using a test tube holder, stand the test tube in a beaker of boiling water for a few minutes. Note the formation of a silver mirror on the inside of the test tube. No silver mirror is formed in the case of propanone. Using your textbook, explain why this is the case. This concludes the experiment.